Hi, this is Gracie. How can I help you tonight? Yeah, hi. I need you to tell me what you're wearing. What do you want me to be wearing, honey? I'm paying for this shit. You tell me.
Hello? Hello, Gracie. Hey, who is this? It's me. It's Peter. <sighs> Peter. Look, I'm sorry. I, I can't talk right now. I have to. You don't remember last night, then? What? No. No, why should I? Look, what the fuck is going on? I'm sorry it had to be a secret. I didn't think you'd come on your own. A fucking secret? How the fuck did you get me here? Just some chloroform. Nothing dangerous. Why, Peter? It's a little hard to explain. Yeah. You've locked me in a fucking animal cage! I know. I need to keep you there for a while. Look, just don't panic, okay? Oh, I know, Peter. What for? Are you gonna kill me? <laughs> I'm not going to kill you, no. Nothing will happen. So it's sex then? Well, look, I don't know. Okay. Peter, this is freaking me out. If it's sex, then just tell me, and we can do it, and I can go. We can discuss this all very soon. I've got to go now. Wait, no, 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 please, wait, wait. What? I have these pills I need to take, and I've run out, and I really need them. What are they? They're called, um, Devil Pro X. I really need them. I'll see what I can do. Yeah, uh, D-I-V-A-L. Thank you. You're welcome. How long do we need to stay here for? Not long. Look, there's enough food and water for a week. And Gracie, you can have your phone. Just don't call the police. A fucking week? Don't call the police. They won't be able to track you there. Okay. So what am I supposed to do now? Hey, honey, how's it going? Yeah, okay. She at work. I'm not sure I can keep up with these hours. Boss got me in on Tuesday. Now Eddie? Can I really... What? I need to tell you something, and I need you not to get pissed, okay? Um, okay. A client came to my apartment. Jesus fucking Christ, Gray, why? It doesn't matter. Does matter? Did you have sex with him? No. I don't know. You don't know. Jesus, that's a new one. I know, I know, and I'm sorry, but you've got to listen. I'm sorry, yeah. Why? What now? He drugged me. What? He 
drugged me in. I don't... I don't know what happened last night. Fuck. It's got me locked in this kind of prison place. Prison? Where? It's the thing I don't know. Is it in the city, or...? I don't know! Who is this guy? He's called, um... Peter. He's... He's a new one I told you about. Shit. Have you called the cops? No, I can't. And... Well, he told me not to. He said he's coming back, so I'm just gonna see what he wants. Can you not get out? No. Why? I'm chained up. What? Please, leave, leave it to me. And don't tell Mom. I mean, she called earlier, asking if you were with me. Well, next time, say I am. Say I'm asleep or something. Okay, I'll try. I won't tell her about this shit. Look, it's... It's fine, okay? I, I'll see you tomorrow. No, I I'll come and find you. I don't know where I am, Eddie! Hey, Mom. Hey, honey. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. How about you guys? Oh, we're okay. Tried to call you last night. You weren't there. Tried Eddie, but he didn't know where we were either. Mom, I'm 27 years old. <laughs> Taylor's band were playing with stories. I was down there. Uh, so what are you up to today, honey? Oh, not much. I had that dream again last night, Mom. And with the crying. Oh, were you taking your pills? Yeah. They really miss her, Mom. Oh, I know you do, dear. We all do. You know about Dr. Meadow 
said, though. I know, but she doesn't know what it's She's like. She's a very good doctor, Grace, and the people from the foster care center said they'd look at your case. She said the pills will make you less emotional. I don't want to be less emotional. She was my daughter. Don't just want her back. You'll start me off. How's Eddie dealing with it? Yeah. He seems better than me, but you know, he's a guy. He doesn't talk. You seeing him tonight? No, I don't think so. Well, I think you need to be with someone tonight. I'll get your father to drive over and pick you up. I'll make brownies. No, I can't tonight. Why? What are you doing? I just can't. Why are you being so strange with me? I know when there's something wrong, you're still my daughter, remember? I just want to be alone tonight. No. I'll be okay. Don't just sit in getting drunk. <laughs> I want more. Look, I'll call you tomorrow. Okay. Make sure you do. I love you, honey. I love you too. I'll be okay, you know? Thanks. Let's say hi to Dad for me. Will do. Bye. Love you. Bye. Hi. Still here. Spoke to mom. Was she okay? Yeah, I guess. And then she knew something was wrong. Look, remember, she calls you again. Just stay in with you. I have to sleep, okay? I called the cops. And what did they say? Well, they said, well, they asked how long you'd be missing, and they said you need to be gone for like 48 hours before they start looking. <laughs> Jesus, did you tell them what happened? Yeah, but look, they said this sort of shit is not unusual. Not fucking unusual! Yeah, for people in your line of work. What do you mean? Well, okay, they asked me what you did for a living, so... What did you tell them, Eddie? Uh, look, I said you were... Uh, I mean, I told them you were a prostitute. I don't think it helped. I'm not a prostitute! <laughs> Jesus, will you just think about things before you say them? Gracie, you fuck some guy who's chained you up in a cage. Just think about Kayla and getting her back. Okay. So what happens now? <sighs> look, they said they were after 48 hours, so tomorrow sometime, I guess, if, if you've got any idea where you are. I'm near an airport. Messages and one saved message. To hear your saved message, press one. Hi, honey, it's your mom. Everything's fine here. She's having a lovely time with Grandpa. Kayla, come say hello to Mommy. She's having a great day. Okay, gotta go. Bye, Mommy. Say bye, Mom. Yes. <laughs> 
Honest with me, it'd be easier. I need to let my family know when I'm gonna be home. I'm just a normal man, Gracie. I just need this. What? I need to have this going on. So I'm not the first person you've done this to. Oh God, yeah. Of course. There's no one else. <laughs> just you. Well, I'm flattered. I'm just a normal man, Gracie. So what is this then, Peter? Is it just a sexual thing? Look, it's a little more complicated than that. You can be honest with me, I don't mind. Let me just go down the regular road, you know? Finding nice girls into bondage and stuff. Yeah, great first date. <laughs> Look, I'm back soon, so I'll try and come and see you. Look, Peter, I really want to see you, but uh, you have to promise me my medication, okay? I won't be much fun without it. Okay, okay. Thanks, Gracie. You sit tight there. Oh, and Gracie. Yeah. If I were to bring along some clothes later, I'll look at this matter. What sort of thing? Yeah, sure. Size six. Really? Look, let's talk tomorrow. We can work this out. <clears throat> okay. Peter. Can I take this chain off my leg, please? Uh, look, I don't know. Let's see tomorrow. Bye. Hey. I'll see you tomorrow.
Bob Blake. We're not home right now, so please leave a message. Hey, Mom, it's me. I'm just calling to say hey. I'm feeling a lot better. I'm seeing Eddie tomorrow, but maybe we can hook up after? Anyway, I gotta go. Say hi to Dad for me. Love you. Bye. Yeah. Like, I think it might be okay. Really? How? Well, I basically had to tell him that I'd be his girlfriend when he lets me out of here. <laughs> and he bought that? Yeah. He seemed to be getting pretty excited about it on the phone. What a loser. Probably jerking his little cock off while he spoke to him. Yeah. That's what he does. <laughs> Look, any news on finding me? Yeah. Uh, the cops have had each of the database, and I mentioned the airport. So, what are they doing? Great, we don't even know what state you're in. It's gonna be really tough. You need to call them so they can track your cell. No, it's okay. I can do it alone. Look, I gotta go. I wanna preserve this battery. Okay, I love you. I love you too. How's your flight? Delayed. Are you okay? I'm fine. Did you manage to get my pills? Yes. I have them right here. Well, hey, being weird with me. I'm looking forward to seeing you later. It's gonna be fun. Enough, Gracie. Enough. Peter, why are you being like this? I've had a stressful time, okay? I don't like being fucked about. What's fucking you about? Everyone is a fucking liar. What? I'm not going to be back tonight. More likely tomorrow morning now. I'm going to be tired. You're not going to fuck me about, are you, Gracie? No, of course not. You said we'd have sex. Is that still happening? Yeah, if you stop talking to me like that. I'll talk to you any way I want. You're the one chained up in a cage, aren't you? <sighs> You're really not great with women, are you? Look, just bring me my pose and I promise you can do whatever you want. You better keep that promise. <laughs> Threats now. Yeah. Sandra and Bob Blake. We're not home right now, so please leave a message. Hey, Mom, it's me. Pick up if you're there. I'm just calling to say hey. Gracie, Gracie, it's me. I'm here. Shit. Mom, what's up? It's your father. They took him what? in an ambulance. Why? What happened? Well, he's had... He said he felt ill at dinner, and I, I think he's had a heart attack. Oh, is he okay? Oh, I'm so scared, Gray. Okay, okay, okay. Calm down. What did the ambulance guy say? Well, nothing. They took him straight away. They, they gave him those electric shock things. Are you going to go to the hospital? I had a glass of wine at 
dinner. I can't drive. Will you come and take me in? Mom, Mom, just, just get a cab, okay? I'll be there as soon as I can. Which hospital was he at? He's a, he's a Northwest. Okay, uh, I'm out of town, so I'm going to be a little while, okay? But where are you? Eddie and I took a trip to see his parents. Please come back, honey. Yeah, like you've done a big hug for me. I love you. I love you, too. <laughs> I've been kidnapped and I, I, I'm in a cage. Okay, can I please take your name? Yeah, it's Gracie, Gracie Blake. Can you tell me when this happened, Gracie? Uh, three days ago? Look, there should be someone looking for me. Do you know the identity of the person who kidnapped you? Yeah, well, no, he's, his name's Peter, but that's about it. And do you know where you're being kept? No, but it's near an airport, I think. In Seattle? No, that's the thing. Look, my, my boyfriend, Eddie Murano, reported me, okay? There should be someone looking for me. Can you just trace this call? My name is Gracie Blake. I think you're looking for me. Okay, just let me get my system up and running. What was the name again, please? Gracie! Gracie Blake! Uh, yeah, missing since the third. Can you tell me where you are, Miss Blake? No, that's the thing! This guy, he came and he drugged me and he locked me in a fucking cage! Oh, okay. Okay, so talk me through what happened on the night of the abduction. Look, did you just tell me you can find me? You give me all the facts, we'll have a much better idea of where to start. Guy, his name's Peter, okay? I don't know his last name. He came to my apartment and he drugged me and I think he used chloroform. So you know this man? No, 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 he's, he's like a good client of mine. Okay, I never met him before this. And is he there now? No, he's not been here. He, 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 he phones me. He said he's in Florida. Florida? Yes, Florida, and he said he's coming back tonight. Can you just check the flights or something? Leave all that to us. You said he's a client. What line of work, Miss Blake? Challenge, okay? I'm, I'm not a prostitute. Okay, can you explain? Guys, they call me and they jerk off while I talk to them, okay? I don't want to do it, but I have to. Look, Miss Blake, I don't care what you do. I just want to find you. Now, can you describe where you're being held? Uh, it's a, like a big warehouse. It, it's made of metal and it's a dome shape. And are there any windows you can see out of? No, but I, I think I'm near an airport. Like, really near. Okay, thank you. We're gonna run this information through our system, see if it matches anywhere in the Seattle area. We can also run a trace on the call. Can I call you back on this number? Yeah. No, 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 I need to get out of here. I need to see my dad. He's in hospital, I really need to see him. Okay, we're gonna do all we can. I'll call you back soon. You need to remain calm. Are you okay to do that? <laughs> Just get me out of here! <laughs> Thank you.
Peter. Please let me out of here. If you let me out of here, I promise I'll never say a thing to anyone. I need to see my dad. He's had a heart attack and he's in the hospital. 
I know you said you need to keep me here, but this is really important. I might not see my dad again. <laughs> and I don't want to die in here without saying goodbye. <laughs> Wait, my dad's rich, okay? He'll pay you if you let me out of here. Please look after my dad for me. He's sick. Please make him better. Please look after my mom too. You can tell her I love her and that it'd be good. If you've taken my dad already, then can you tell him that me and Kate love him? Okay, yeah. I'm so sorry I had to take you. Oh God, if you want to take me too, then that's fine. Just uh, Oh, it's me. Oh, God, Gracie, where are you? Where the hell no. have you been? Jesus Christ, have you got any idea how worried we've been, Gracie? But why no, I'm do you sorry. do this? Why do you constantly let us down? You let everyone down. How do you think your father has felt you not turning up? Is he okay? You let your daughter down, too, you know? You do know that, don't you? Mom, just stop, okay? I 
need to tell you something. It's me. Where the fuck have you been? I've been calling for days. No, don't start. I'm sorry, okay? Are you out? No. Then why the fucking silence then? You took my phone. What? Why? I, I, I called the cops and he punished me. But I got it back now and I got my pills. He punished you? God, if I ever meet this fucking guy. Did you hear about my dad? Yeah, of course I have. Your mom's been on the phone to me like every five minutes asking where you are. Did you tell her? I said I didn't know. Jesus Christ, what are we gonna do now? I don't know. I can't ever knowing about this, not with my dad. I get it. Look, I gotta go. Battery. Okay. I love you, honey. I I I'll call the cops. They should have tracked your cell by now. Love you, too. Hello. Gracie, it's me. What do you want? Look, I'm sorry about the phone. If I'd known about your dad, I would have returned it earlier, but I was away. How do you know about that? The same way I knew you called the police. I told you not to do that, Gracie. What do you expect me to do? I know, I know. Look, I've charged your cell so we can keep talking. <sighs> You have to let me out of here now. It's not finished. Stranger. Hey, Dad, how are you? Yeah, not too bad. How are you? I gotta lay down for three days straight, so that's good. I'm fine. Sounds relaxing. No, it is. So your mom told me you're in Europe. That sounds like a fun trip. Yeah, it's been amazing. Some great cities. So you, you've been in London? We loved it there. Where are you now? Spain. Flying home though soon, though, Dad, to see you. Don't you come home on my behalf. You can enjoy yourself. Let's not screw around the subject, Dad. How's the ticker? Yeah, some better days, I think. Doctors give me ten to live. Ten what? Nine, eight, <laughs> seven. Shut <six. laughs> So when can you come home? Uh, I got more tests in the morning. What for? You'll have to ask your mom. More tubes in places tubes ain't supposed to be. Ouch. You get better, Dad. See you soon, okay? Love you. Yeah, okay, honey. You guys have a great time. Don't you worry about me. Oh, do you want to speak to your mom? Yeah, sure. She said she doesn't want to speak to you, dear. Something about your annoying voice. Oh, stop <laughs> it. Thanks for calling, dear. Thanks, Mom. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Love you. Bye.
Hey, Mom. Oh, Gracie. They're so sorry. No. <laughs> no. The hospital's called. No, 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 no! God, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Disappear. Of course. And anything you want, just, just ask, just tell me. Okay, look. I'm not a monster. I know you think I am, but I'm not really. It doesn't matter. If you let me go, I, I will be grateful forever. Okay, Gracie. I'm flying to San Francisco now, but I'll be in Seattle tomorrow morning. I'll knock on the door of the warehouse to let you know I am there. But it'd be better if you don't see me. When I knock, cover your head with your blanket. Do you understand? Yeah, of course, of course. And thank you so much, Peter. You don't know what this means. Okay, okay. Look, I fly back into Seattle tomorrow at 8.30. Once I'm out of the airport, it will take me 15 minutes to get to you. See you tomorrow. Straight over. I'm sorry, Mom. I'll see you tomorrow. I love you. Okay. Hey, you've reached Eddie Moreno. I'm either too busy or too lazy to pick up. Leave a message. Hey, honey. It's me. I did it. I think I'm gonna be okay. Call me back. I love you.
so sorry I missed your call. What's going on? I spoke to Peter. He's gonna let me go. Why? What did he say? I told him about Dad and... Like, this guy's a psycho, already. He said he's gonna let me go because of Mom. Where are you? Uh, I'm in Seattle, I think. Okay, how, how do you know? He said I'm about 15 minutes from SeaTac, so... Okay, shit, should I, should I call the cops, or...? No, 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 no. Let's get the car ready for the morning and I'll call you when I'm out. Okay, great, I, I'll be waiting. C call me tonight if you need me. Okay, gotta go. I want to preserve this battery so I can call you tomorrow. See you soon. Get out of here from my head. Yeah, I'm gonna get you out. I need you to describe the building you're in. I've already described it to the police. Well, then now you can describe it to me. Metal? Okay. It's like a big 
tin dome building. Got a curved roof. Can you hear anything outside? I need the plane. <laughs> Even they've stopped now. Look, I'm gonna work out what's 15 minutes from SeaTac and drive around. It's, it's crazy that the two towers came down. What with people in it? My battery is gonna die soon, Eddie. What happens then? Don't worry, I'll find you. Bye. I love you. Tell my mom I love her. You can tell her it yourself. I'm going to get you right now.
still trying. I really am. Doesn't matter. Christ, are you okay? I found that dress. Shit, what is it? <laughs> Unit 7. Unit 7? Okay. That's the industrial center. Brotherland Avenue. Brother, brother what? Brotherland Avenue. Brotherland. Okay, I'll, I'm on my way. Yeah. About ten minutes away, honey. Okay, stay with me. How's your battery? It's bad. I'll be with you soon, honey. Okay, don't worry. I'm gonna die here. Eddie. No, 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 you're not. You're gonna be fine. Just hold on. Come on. Come on. Jesus, this fucking traffic, right? You still there, Gracie? Yeah, Gracie. Yeah. Okay. We'll laugh about this one day, you know, when we're old. Tell our grandkids by the time that I rescued grandma. <laughs> okay, I need five more minutes, okay? Did I mention that I'm taking you out to dinner tomorrow night? My treat, honest. Anyway, you wanna go? Apart from the Chinese place, you know, I hate that place. Great, are you there? Yeah. Good. Okay, I'm getting close. I'm gonna be. Hang on. Shit. Uh, I'm gonna try and uh, I'm gonna try and lose them. Okay, just stay with me. Stay with me. Shit. No, no, no! Don't be assholes. Sandra and Bob Lake. We're not home right now, so please leave a message. Mom, it's me. I'm sorry for everything. I'm okay. You don't have to worry. I'm gonna go now so I won't be any more trouble. I'm so sorry, it couldn't be more for you and Dad. I tried. And we both, we both tried. Eddie and I. And Kayla. She loved you, Mom. I love you. You have no new messages and one saved message. To hear your saved message, press one. Hi, honey, it's your mom. Everything's fine here. She's having a lovely time with Grandpa. Kayla, come and say hello to mommy. She's having a great day. Okay, 
gotta go. Bye, mommy. Say bye, mommy. i uh -huh.